Hey everybody, I'm in my Airbnb in Los Angeles now and we are going to be making a poke bowl. It's a, it's a hybrid poke bowl. I'm using ingredients that I've found in Whole Foods and we're going to be putting it together. It's super fast and it's going to be a quick stir fry. Our basic ingredients are olive oil, I have some sesame, roasted sesame oil, liquid aminas, which is like a soy sauce derivative, our tuna cuts, these are like tuna steaks, which I'm going to be slicing into Nice slices so I can pan sear it. I have some lemon juice ready with some peppercorns in it. And then uh, we have some avocados, garlic, some snow peas, nori, and uh, some grilled artichokes. So I've already cooked the rice. We're using some black rice, which is there. And everything's gonna go together really fast and it's gonna be super yummy. So lemon with peppercorns, that was the lemon. We have a lemon tree in the back, which is pretty cool. This is the liquid aminas, which is like a soy sauce derivative. Olive oil, roasted sesame oil, soapy garlic, artichokes, and nori. All right, let's get this show going. So first up, I will be slicing these guys to make them more bite-sized. Getting rid of things like this. I have washed these already, so washed it and broke off the stems okay and then we'll be chopping up our garlic Ooh, nice and soft ready to go starting already and filming it Right, then the artichoke hearts. I just need to stir fry these in. They look super yummy. Okay, then we're gonna be pre mixing our sauce. This is lemon juice and some peppercorns. I don't have black peppercorns, so we are using red peppercorns. So we're sort of making like a, a ponzu sauce. Pan on medium heat, some olive oil. While we're waiting for the pan to heat up, I'm gonna add some more pepper pan. We're gonna cut it into chunks so that we can keep a semi-raw inside. There you go. Right. Throw our garlic in. And then add all the And then the tuna chunks in. Okay, fire off. 
Looking at that. Still in the pan. And then we're just gonna drizzle some sesame oil onto it as our last touch. Gives it a very Asian flavor. Sesame oil. Beautiful. I love sesame oil. Ah, you can smell the aroma of the roasted sesame oil. So this is like a variation for a poke bowl. Um, we wanted to cook the fish because it wasn't fresh catch. And that's it. We're gonna start plating. Last step, add the nori and then add some avocado. Here it is, guys. Let's hold that in the light. Doesn't work. Here you go. So seared tuna and artichokes with some snow peas, nori, avocado, and black rice. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm super hungry. It looks amazing. Let's hope it's good. It looks amazing. It will be. So we're gonna have our lunch in the front yard. Get some water. Some construction next door. Ah, oh, that's it. Get <laughs> the camera. <laughs> oh no, where'd my food go? <laughs> it's good, guys. Super good. Mixed with some chili sauce and some sparkling water and great company. Yeah. Definitely must eat. So, I'm still going through mine. So I probably have black rice in my tea, but <laughs> it's all worth it. You should give this a name, honey. It's it's not a poke bowl because it's cooked already. So I don't know what to name it. It's a bowl. It's a bowl, definitely. So. But it's it is inspired from poke, even with the sauce that I used and the ingredients that we put in. Terrific tuna bowl. Terrific tuna bowl. <laughs> By Angie King. So again guys, uh, snow peas, some artichokes, black rice, uh, avocado, the nori paper. The sauce that we use is lemon with uh, peppercorns and some liquid aminas or soy sauce and then stir fry everything together and that's what you get. Scrumptious and delicious and I love it. It's one of my favorite, most favorite meals that you've ever prepared. Oh wow, that's, that's saying really, a lot. You know why? Because there's so many... Um, flavors and senses that stimulating my palate my tongue is alive with taste <laughs> because the avocado is so soft and then i love the the black rice and the artichoke because it's fermented artichoke yes so it's got that it's, nice salty it's a grilled fermented artichoke oh, so good and then you've got the tuna in itself and then the snow peas is that crisp the crunchy yeah, so it's texture and texture taste and yeah, it's terrific tuna bowl Terrific tuna bowl. I think we'll <laughs> name it that. Terrific tuna bowl. There you go, guys. Maybe this afternoon I will be baking something for you guys. So we were in Whole Foods this morning and rather than buy cookies that were pre-made already, I found ingredients. So I'm going to be making some cookies and rather than using sugar, we're going to be trying to use some honey in the cookies. So it's going to be a honey chocolate chip cookie. I can see it already, honey. So with my crocheting and my my weaving <laughs> wall art 
and then your cookies and light healthy meals. I see something. There's a union here. It's an elderly union. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's aunties unite. Aunties, aunties AF during quarantine. I'm so sorry about the noise next door. They're constructing still and um, construction still allowed to go on even though it's quarantine mode. But this is um, what the best we can do for the stay at home video that we're trying to produce so that you guys have something to watch and uh, kill the time in and your area and learn something. <laughs> yes. All right, guys, I'm gonna cut right here and hopefully we'll string it up with a baking video later. Bye.